Are your eyes bothering you? Not just the occasional dryness or redness, but regular discomfort and irritation that can get in the way of living your normal life? You may have meibomian gland dysfunction or evaporative dry eye. Hi, I'm Dr. Marguerite McDonald of the Ophthalmic Consultants of Long Island, and I'm here with Dr. Eric Donenfield, my colleague at OCLI. And we are both corneal specialists. We treat dry eye disease, and as it turns out, we both have dry eye disease. So today we're going to be demonstrating the Lipiflow and Lipiview system, which is designed to help such patients. And uh, we'll start with Dr. Donenfeld, who has taken a short questionnaire. We're going to review the questionnaire, uh, look at his oil layer of his tear film, very important in dry eye disease, and express his oil glands to see how severe his dry eye disease is. So it looks, Dr. Donenfeld, as if uh, by answering this questionnaire, you most definitely have dry eye disease. What are your symptoms? Well, I've had burning and irritation for several years. Uh, it comes and goes, but it's usually worse in the morning. Uh, it's quite irritated. Uh, I certainly do fine with it, but I've been looking for a diagnostic test to tell me exactly what's wrong with my lid margins, and I've certainly been looking for a better way of treating it than what I've been doing in the past, which is hot compresses. Well, very good. Well, let's move on to the next step, which is evaluation of the oil layer. The lip view takes detailed images of your tear film during a non-invasive in-office exam. And the tear film is composed of three major components. Most patients feel that they don't make enough tears, enough water in their tear film, but actually more important and more commonly, patients don't have the proper oil content in their tear film. This is the first machine that actually allows clinicians to measure the oil component of your tear film to show you what's wrong with your tear film and why you have dry eye. Much of the focus of dry eye treatment has been on supplementing the tear film with the use of drops and ointments. However, 65% of patients with dry eye symptoms actually suffer from evaporative dry eye, a real disease that could worsen if left untreated. Evaporative dry eye disease is most often caused by meibomian gland dysfunction, a blockage or obstruction in the meibomian glands, which can lead to a lipid deficiency in the tears. This blockage causes symptoms such as watering, gritty feeling in eyes, and itching. If left untreated, blocked glands can stop functioning altogether. Hi, my name is Richard, and I'm one of the technicians here at OCLI, and today we're gonna do your lip view test. Okay, and I'll just have you Come forward and just rest your chin in there and your forehead up against the top bar. Okay. Good. And all you're going to do is just look straight ahead and just blink as you would normally. Now we're just going to move over here to your left eye. And same thing, just look straight ahead and blink as you would normally and relax. Great. Sit back. Good. All right. Now we'll just process this information. Here are close up images of Dr. Donenfeld's eyes as captured by the Lipiview system. You can see colors swirling in his tear film. Those represent the oils. It's almost like the way you look at a puddle of gasoline in the garage and you can see all the colors swirling there. That represents how much oil and how many different types of oil are present in the tear lake. So this is white light interferometry. And now we're going to show you Dr. Donenfeld's blink pattern. Now, the average thickness of the tear leg for a healthy person who has no dry eye is 70 microns or even higher. So 70 to 50 is mild dry eye, and below 50 is fairly severe dry eye. So here's the analysis. Well, several things you notice. First, the average here is 49 and here's 50, so this is a dry eye. Remember I said 70 and above is normal, so this is definitely a dry eye. Also, there should be a nice hockey stick between blinks. Here's a blink, here's a blink, here's a blink in the left eye. So the lipid should be drawn up and then drop, and you see it's pretty much a flat line. So these are definitely eyes that need to be treated with the Lipiflow system. We're about to start the treatment our first step is to put topical anesthetic in both eyes. So go ahead, Richard. Just an eye drop. Go ahead and blot, Dr. Donafel. I've had this treatment myself, and it's very comfortable. 
like a spa treatment. You ready, Richard? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now just look up, please, again, Dr. Donenfeld. So as you see, the lid massagers have been gently inserted and the treatment is underway. The reason that this works so much better than hot compresses is that when a patient puts a hot compress on their closed lids, the heat has to get all the way through the lid to the oil glands, which are located on the back side of the lid, closer to the eyeball, basically geographically inaccessible. Here, the lid massagers are right there. They're on either side of the lid, applying heat to places that we simply can't reach, even with the hottest of hot compresses. In a clinical study at four weeks after treatment, 79% of patients reported improvement in dry eye symptoms. So Eric, how are you feeling? I'm feeling comfortable. It's like having a, a, a little mini massage. And uh, describe the warmth. Is it pleasant? You know, I, I think this is a, a very smart, holistic approach. Uh, in the past, we used oral medications sometimes to treat this disease. I think mean, this just makes sense. It's a therapeutic effect that is applied holistically, that treats the problem, doesn't use medications or chemicals. Uh, I like the concept. I think it's just good for patients to approach this disease in this type of manner. The treatment is now over. It was only 12 minutes. And now with Richard's uh, assistance, we will take out the gear, the lid massagers. We're going to just gently remove the tape. So that one's out and open your eyes again. There you go. Now we're going to sit you up. I can see. How do you feel? <laughs> How do you feel? I feel fine. It's uh, um, a very simple test. I actually, my, my lids feel actually a little different. They feel lighter. It's, it's a different feeling. They, before, they felt kind of clogged and uh, you can almost feel that they've, uh, they're functioning better already. It's a, it's a nice feeling. You know, Oakley is the uh, dry eye experts, not only for Long Island, but possibly for the entire country. Uh, we have the experts that really change the way clinicians practice ophthalmology throughout the world. And our access to new technology like the LipaView and the LipaFlow units are our commitment to excellence, that we want to be providing our patients on Long Island with the best care available anywhere in the world. We have patients coming to us from everywhere because they know that if you want to have the best clinical results, you'll find them right here at Oakley on Long Island.